Hello everyone, my name is The Cure, and today I'm going to do, well as you saw in the title, kind of an apology video because if you've been following my videos you probably have seen that I haven't actually made a single video in about three weeks, which is pretty crazy because I do about two or three videos per week, uh, usually on the weekends. So um, as an apology video, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you kind of a sneak peek of my full Rubik's Cube collection. So I'm just going to show you all the Rubik's Cubes I have so far, but I'm supposed to be getting a lot more. So, basically in this video, I'll be just showing you my entire Rubik's Cube collection as of right now. So let's get started. Alright guys, so I'm back, and for this and for this video, we're going to be starting off with 2x2s. Two two. So, basically I'm just going to be showing you the cubes one by one. So, this is my first cube. This is a Rubik's Brand 2x2. Two two. Uh, it's... Pretty slow, but yeah, it's Rubik's Brand 2 video. The next cube I want to show you is my Diane Zanchi Black 2x2, which is extremely good. Um, definitely, you should you should definitely get this cube. It's really nice, really smooth. Uh, my next 2x2 is this uh, Tankpo, Mojo Tankpo. Really good cube. Um, or no, sorry, this is not the Moyu Tango. This is the Moyu Lingpo. Uh, it's really, really fast. Uh, kind of crunchy, but it's really fast, and corner cutting is pretty good. Uh, so, also, I recommend this 2x2 two two a lot, also. Pretty good cube. So, that's all my 2x2s. Two the next cube I'm, the next cubes I'm going to be showing you are the 3x3s. So, I'm going to start off with this uh, Moyu Suwang 3x3, three three, even though it's actually not the Moyu Suwang. It's kind of like... I guess an older version or something like that because I ordered it, but it came, for some reason I got this cube instead, so I just have this in my collection now. So it's just some like kind of other cube that I got. Um, I guess you could call it the Moyu Suwang, even though it's not what I was supposed to get. It's not the actual Moyu Suwang. So yeah, this is just 3x3. Then we have the Rubik's Brand 3x3. This is uh, uh, one of the newer versions, but it's not the newest. Uh, so yeah, next cube is this uh, new the newest Rubik's Band three x three. Uh, so yeah, I have both uh, Rubik's Band three x threes. So I have this cube. Um, a little bit better, but it's still not the best. Uh, come come more three x threes. I have this Duncan Speed cube. Which is, if you've seen my review on this it's actually a really nice cube uh definitely recommend buying it uh so yeah just the dumbest speed cube probably my best cube i have my best three by three i have then i have this three or three sudoku cube which is like it's extremely hard to solve i actually haven't even i don't even know how to solve it yet it's like so hard to solve but since it's three by three i decided i would add it to this part of the video so uh, yeah just a Sudoku cube. The last three by three I have is this V cube three pillowed, um, and it's actually pretty fast. It just has a weird feeling to it. So pretty nice. Just kind of feels weird because it's like curved. Uh, corner cutting's kind of okay. You do like right below forty five degrees, which is or not forty five degrees. There is uh right below a block, which is not the best, but uh, it's not too bad. It's pretty fast though. It's smooth. Alright, so that's all the three by threes I have. So now uh, I'm gonna move on to four by fours. I only actually have one four by four. It's just this Rubik's Band four by four, but I'm actually gonna be getting another one pretty soon. Uh, so yeah, just a Rubik's Band four by four. Uh, not the best. It's actually not really that great. Um, it's just really slow and kind of strange turning kind of just like uh, it's kind of just not really doesn't really feel great after that we have uh we're going to move on to paramings and kind of cubes like that so i have this um just a shang shao paramings um i actually used to have the mefferts paramings uh but i gave that away uh so this is just my shang shao paramings this is the my main paramix that I have now, really good cube. 
really, really fast. So, like, really nice too. So, yeah, you should definitely buy this. Um, just really a great cube. Uh, it also clicks, which is pretty cool. It clicks in, uh, clicks in when you turn it, so that's good. Uh, really nice cube. After that, we have the Paramorphix, um, which is kind of like the Paramink, except it only has these corners and then the centerpiece. But it turns really strangely. It turns into a bunch of different shapes, as you can see. Uh, it's pretty difficult to solve at first, but then it's actually not that hard once you get used to it. Uh, not that fast, but... It's not that fast, but... I mean, it's kind of... It's not really used for speed solving. It's just kind of a cube to play with. Uh, so, yeah, just the paramorphics. So after that, I'm just going to kind of do just some random cubes I have. Um, I have this... Uh, uh, Christmas 3x3, three three, like mini 3x3. Three three. It's actually not too bad for such a small cube. Uh, yeah, not really much to say about this cube. After that, I have some kind of just strange looking cubes. I have, um, have the Rubik's Cheese, um, which is, uh, it's really loose. As you can see, it's actually, it's crazy loose. But when you first get it, it's kind of tight, and then these, the side, this, uh, side is kind of tight, but also it gets looser as you turn it and mix it up and solve it. Uh, actually, really easy to solve, but it's still fun. So this is a cube, and I actually have another one of those. I have two of these. This one's like all taped up and doesn't work anymore. I just decided to tape it up just so I could turn it and like this part and this part, just because I wanted to just see if I could turn it. Uh, so I have two. This one broke. Um, this kind of like gear came out and it won't go back in, so I had to get this one. Um, but still a pretty fun solve. After that, I have the boob cube, boob cube uh, you can call it, um, or the 2x2x1, two by two by um, which is, I mean, just like you can only turn one side, so it's just not how much to really to say about this, just a, just a little, I guess, little cube. To just turn, I guess. And then the last cube I have is this little, uh, really tiny, world's smallest 3x3. Uh, it's pretty slow, but kind of, I guess you could say it's kind of fast for such a small cube. It's like so tiny, it's hard to turn. Uh, so, just like a mini 3x3, I've only solved it like twice because it's so hard to turn and solve quickly with this, with like, because it's so small. Um, so, yep. So, that's pretty much it for this video. That's all the cubes I have. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And also, I'll be going back to my regular schedule of videos. So, um, make sure you stay tuned for more videos. And I'll see you in the next video.